Oh, I wonder what adventures we'll have in Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep today. Why, Ventus is going to pay a visit to Deep Space, the best named world of all of Kingdom Hearts. They couldn't have come up with a better name other than just, it's deep in space. That's it. There's nothing else to it. Surfing in on our Keyblade uh, hoverboard. Huh? What's that? So, first. so right off the bat, we get in a fight with a giant unversed. Try that again. Don't even remember this unversed's name. Take out the giant unversed. It's like Big Boy Floatsome McDunkle the Third, I think. Glider battles. Yeah, yeah, I know. So we can't heal in this battle, and look at that, that health bar. <laughs> so we're just gonna have to keep hitting him over and over again. Now thankfully we don't have to take out all of his HP. That would be excruciatingly painful if we did. So we're just gonna keep beating him up. Oh wow! Okay, well, <laughs> that happened. Looks like Ventus is not as strong as Terra was. But also, it's just been a while since I fought this guy. And I forgot that you actually do have to defend against his attacks. Weird that you can like jump while you're floating in zero gravity. Um, thanks for not letting me do the, the defend move. Wow! You know, it sure is annoying to have to fight an enemy when you've got only an extremely wimpy attack and no possible way to heal yourself. That's always fun. Big boy floats in McDunkle the third is definitely a tough boss. Not his name. Don't know what this fane is called. I couldn't even get an opportunity to guard. He initiated that attack when I was in the middle of attacking and there was nothing I could have done to stop it. He didn't have any visual cues before I pushed the attack button. Yeah, I remember this fight being obnoxious. I didn't remember it being this bad, though. The camera is also not helping things. Oh, I, I love that my barrier wore off right as the attack happened. I was literally mashing the guard button, and it wasn't doing anything. Great. This fight sucks. Oh, you should have gotten all free HP boosts, and played the game on beginner mode. Excuse me, and you can't even, like, combo this guy. Like, you hit him one time with the Keyblade, and that's it. And you can attack, like, once every five seconds. Once again, just would not let me guard. There we go, finally! And we get the Windblade command style for doing that. Yeah, Ventus gets his command styles pretty quickly. We'll just see about that. We literally just disappeared. <laughs> just phased out of existence. Jeez. 
deep space. Oh boy, I just can't wait. Stitch, you're in prison now. Now don't get any more ideas. These guns are locked into your genetic signature. Huh. An intruder? All right, you. Don't get any funny ideas. <laughs> You'd think that they would have expected that or something. Spit is the true hero for Stitch. So you're the intruder. Identify yourself. My name is Ventus. <laughs> How many of us, when confronted by a giant whale alien aiming a gun at our face and is like, who the heck are you? Is just like, hi, I'm Ventus. Want to be friends? The monster I was chasing boarded your ship. Nice try. If there was another intruder aboard, we'd have detected it. Huh? Intruder in the machinery bay. We lost control of the engines. It's some kind of monster. Now you tell me. Stay right there. I have lots of unpleasant questions to ask you. This is my fault. I have to do something. Gantu was not this evil in the first movie. Dang, he was able to pronounce Aqua. You know Terra and Aqua? Friend. Circle. Aww. Is that a wayfinder? Oh, huh? Huh? The engines are under too much stress. We're risking an explosion. What am I doing? There's no time. Come with me, little guy. Huh? No, you need to stay here. It's too dangerous. Stitch is a better fighter than you, Ventus. <laughs> oh, he's so sad. Oh. All right. Get to explore the spaceship now. High potion. Pulsing crystal. Oh, hi. Oh, yeah. We should de-link Zack. Oh, my gosh. Our attack power is so bad. Are we under-leveled now? I'm so used to being over-leveled as Terra. All right. There we go. Okay, that's what I was looking for. Slottage is such a weird command. Hero's entrance! Hero's entrance is basically just critical impact finisher. And I'm okay with that. Sorry, Zack. Wasn't able to get much done. <laughs> I'm just looking for the nearest shop. Eliminate all the unversed to clear the barriers. All of them? All of them. Okay. I will do my best. That's right. Chaos Snake is still low level. Air Bud Best Boy! Doggone it, that is a bad finisher when used against, uh, when used with Magnara, or any kind of magnet. Oh yeah, we got Thunder Surge, what am I doing? We have nothing to fear. Boom! There we go, that's what I'm talking about now. There we go! We get the Wing Blade command style, which is so cool! Oh my gosh, look at this. We've got a set of wings that are all- that's just made out of swords. And wait till you see the finisher. Boom! It's like a miniature version of Trinity Limit. It's awesome. Also, if we go to stats now, I can't actually remember how you're supposed to enter the Wing Blade command style. Activates when you're already using a command style and follow up with magnet-related commands, edge attacks like Stun Edge, or Reprisals. Reprise? That's interesting. 
I actually had completely forgotten. We also haven't even gone into the Cyclone Clan style because I don't have wind stuff equipped. All right. Magnara plus Zack. What could go wrong? Can I get like um, a Wayfinder upgrade? That would be great. That was beautiful, Ventus. There! Yes, that's what I'm looking for. Now we summon him again! <laughs> Why does this give us stop? I do not understand. Stop does not seem like a very Zack command. Oh, hey, we got triple bells. That's pretty cool. That guy just did not care about stop at all. In your face. Boom! Oh yeah. Nice counter rush. Or counter flurry. Oh. Stitch made his own little Paupu fruit charm. No, how could you? I don't know how you did it, but you won't get away again. Hm. You haven't fooled me. You can bat your eyes all you want at the Grand Councilwoman so she'll reconsider your sentence. But I see you for what you really are. An abomination that's only instinct is to destroy everything it touches. Stitch doesn't seem that mean, even... Like, in We Won't Stitch the movie, Stitch was kind of like a terrible creature at the beginning, but then he learned to become good. Here, he, he became good pretty quickly. I'm impressed, Stitch. You've literally, you've literally beaten your programming to do that. Good job. Yeah. Bada beam, we get the map. Oh, yes, yes. If they sell Esnua here, I would like to buy one. Oh, they do! Yes, I would like to buy one Esnua, please. We've got six Auroras! <laughs> oh, that's great. Uh, we're gonna need one more stop. What else are we gonna need? We could probably use another Aerial Slam, but I don't really want to buy one at this point. Oh, great. All of my stuff is reaching maximum level. That's great. Block as new a Fleeting Crystal. Renewal Block with Attack Haste. I don't know why it gives Attack Haste, but it does. Slot Edge Strike Raid Abounding Crystal gives us Treasure Raid with Lucky Strike, which I think is a very fitting ability to come attached to it. Freeze Raid plus Magnaga with a Soothing Crystal. Gives us Spark Raid with the Defender ability. Spark Raid and Treasure Raid are both exclusive for Ventus. Terra and Aqua are not able to learn those, so... Definitely glad to have those. Let's equip Aerial Slam. That seems pretty great. Uh, do we have another Faraga just hanging out? Oh yeah, we're leveling it up. Cool. We gotta level up our Slow as well, in preparation for melding it with the Fire. Hey, doop, 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 doop. I guess we could level up our Aurora. I can actually show off. <laughs> I can show off the Cyclone command style. Also, <laughs> this is your first time opening the abilities menu. Yeah, apparently it is. All right, we got one of one of these. Okay, we got two of those. No HP boosts. One Thunder boost. We got to get more of the boosts. We also need to get more of the attack hastes. One hundred percent. We also need EXP Walker, although it's a little late in the game to be getting that, but oh well. Also, we're equipping that bad boy renewal block. Oh, yes we are. I can feel my commands charging ever so slightly faster. Oh, it's this room. It's the anti-gravity chamber. Zero Gravera. Well, how nice. Come on. 
Hey, another fleeting crystal. That's that's just so nice. I forgot what Spark Raid looks like. Ooh! That just went everywhere. Well, so much for Aerial Slam. I hit him in the wrong place. I'm not sure if I ever showed off slow. Just slows them down a bit. Ooh, level 3 Thunder Surge. Spark Raid is interesting. There we go. We used Aurora while we were in uh, Fever Pitch Command Style. Now turn us into the Cyclone Command Style. Here we go! It's Cyclone! Whoosh! I feel like half of Ventus's command styles are just like, it's air-based. Yeah. Cool. Haven't seen that before. Okay. Admittedly, that's kind of cool. That's a that's a pretty cool finisher. Good job, Ventus. Oh wow, our Magnera reached max level. Can we meld that? <laughs> oh man, we don't have a regular magnet on hand. That's a quick break time. We actually are going to need break time. We actually need to meld break time with something. So, may as well. Plus, I still need to use it out, use it in order to help get that achievement. Now we don't even need to de-link Snow White in order to use Treasure Raid. Gotcha. The Spark Raid looks cool, but I'm not sure if it's really worth it. Ready? That is extremely precise timing. Wow. Open the chest, Ventus. Fundara. Okay, let's try break time again. Whereas Terra does push-ups, Ventus does some break dancing. Alright, let's see if we can level up that Zack D-Link a little bit more. Um, where did he go? He just disappeared. Yeah. Okay, I need I need to turn the freaking zero gravity off. I'm sending them flying way too high in the air, and that's why they keep disappearing. Ooh, pulse bomb! That is a shot lock that is exclusive to Ventus. That's neat. Neato! I'll equip it later. UFO sticker. I love it. The mega attack recipe! Yay! Super glide over here. Yeah. I do not think we're supposed to get this this early, but we will anyways. Ooh, it's Xehanort's report number one. That's our first Xehanort's report. Let's read it. Much time has passed since I left the home of my youth behind, and in the myriad worlds I have since visited, I have gained much knowledge. On these pages I intend to record a portion of that knowledge and put the course of my life to paper. Upon reflection, my life underwent the most considerable sea change when I arrived at that place. Yes, it began when I found a master, and another I would later call my brother, when I found a new home. Then there was the Keyblade. For what purpose was it begotten, and by whom? During my training with one of its wielders, the precepts offered a clear answer. The Keyblade existed so that we who watched over the light could protect the world from the shadows. But was that the true answer? Could there not be more to it than that? My heart sought knowledge, and so I visited other worlds, though such travel was forbidden unless duty required, and found what my heart sought. Cool, that told me nothing. Thanks, Xehanort. That literally was useless. 
I'm sorry, but I didn't intend other people to read my private diary. Spark Raid was kind of a waste. I think I'd rather have my Magna Gear. Alright, Cyclone! Okay, wait, 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 wait. Oh, shoot. Well, this is bad, actually. Producer, save me! Okay, that's not exactly who I wanted to lock on to at all. I don't have second chance yet, do I? Wait, do I actually not have second chance? I don't. How have I neglected that this much? That's like... <laughs> That's, like, the most important ability. I, I thought I already got it. <laughs> yeah. How have I not gotten it yet? All right. I bet I could get it by uh, melding two Aur auroras together. Fire Surge. Fun. A fleeting Crystal. I don't know why we need to watch this cutscene whenever I to activate the anti-gravity machine. It's not like it's my first time using it. Look, Ma, no hands! Boop, 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 boop. So I believe if we go into the next room, we face off against the boss. Ready? Why is this... Jeez Louise, why... Why is the timing to get the break time down so incredibly precise? And it gets more precise as it goes on. Wow. Okay. Oh, our soul leveled up. That's good. Alright, we're gonna need, like, a really good command in order to take on the boss. Because the boss is actually pretty tricky. But what should it be? Oh, obviously we need a cure. Oh, wait! How long have we had two curas that we could melt together into Kiraga? I think this will give us our second chance. Yeah, Kira Kira Pulsing Crystal. Kiraga with second chance. Boom. Get that equipped right away. Right away. Okay, also, break time is a meme. We're not we're not using that right now. We'll equip, we'll equip Fire Surge instead. It's a much, much better choice. Off to the launch deck. Oh wait, that's where we came from. A plus navigation. No, we're going in here. Oh, look who it is! It's Big Boy Floatsome Mc... <laughs> oh, well, I forget his name already. End of the line. Big Boy Floatus McGurkus the Third. Wow! Hey, you shouldn't be here. As I said, Ventus, he's a better fighter than you are. <laughs> Here we go! Defeat the Unversed. When Experiment 626 starts hopping, throw him at the enemy. Okay. I'll do... I will do my best. So he's gonna latch onto the wall and start damaging it. We don't want him to destroy the ship. Okay. 
Come on. Wow. He just... That attack just never ends. What the heck? Okay, I forgot how tough and annoying this guy is. Wow. Also, Stitch. I thought you were going to do, like, the team-up attack. You weren't. Alright, confuse him with the Chaos Snake. Oh yeah, look at that damage. Oh, I love that damage. I love it. Oh no. Okay! Raining lightning down from above, I see. Thankfully, Fire Surge and Thunder Surge are racking up a bunch of damage. Oh, you cannot be up there. That That's hardly fair. Anti-gravity machine. Come on, finish him. Chaos Snake, I thought you were going to do more damage than that. The <laughs> treasure rate's not doing... The fool! That was a close one, but we get another maximum HP increase. Yay! Take that! <laughs> Take that, big boy Flotus McGurkis the Third. It's over. Cut it out. Rage. What's gotten into you? Oh. I see. Your wayfinder broke. He lost his way. Well, don't worry. Friendship's more than an object. Friendship circle? Mm -hmm. <laughs> don't let the little mimic fool you. You saw for yourself what kind of monster that thing is. You All shot his wayfinder. Was hurt and destroy. Monster? He helped me stop the monster! You must have triggered some sort of mutation hidden in the little freak's genetic coding. Then, friend! That's right. We are friends. Better say your goodbyes now, because 626 is about to be destroyed. <laughs> stop that! <laughs> Stitch be strong, folks. Come on! Sound the alert! On the I'm not a prisoner. I just saved your ship, bro, and died doing it. But then I came back because it's just a game. Oh, I, I love that. <laughs> Where are we going? Hyperdrive has been activated. System charging. Warning. Guidance is not functional. Navigation failure. Do not engage hyperdrive. Repeat. Do not engage. Break formation. Get clear. What is it? What's going on? Look at Jojima. Well, there goes Stitch. Well, there goes Ventus. We forged a D-Link with Experiment 626. Yes, and we get the hyperdrive keyblade. Yes. We never use that as Terra. We're definitely using that as Ventus, though. Definitely. We're gonna just equip that Keyblade right away. Oh yeah, we also got Mark of a Hero, but I like Hyperdrive more, because you got that good balance of strength and magic. Which is what Ventus is all about. And, of course, because it's a boss, we didn't level up any of our commands. Only 81%?! Oh, oh heck no. 
gotta go back here. Doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop. Yeah, we never went to the Turo Transporter. And we can use the stitch delay. Which is great, because eventually then we can get doubled CP from all this stuff. Probably should have gone to an easier world to level up the D-Links first and then went over here, but that would have been the intelligent thing to do. Yay! Our first D-Link flower with attack boost. Man, Aurora stinks! It deals like no damage. I wish I knew how I... Tr oh, that's right. I can't trigger Wing Blade because I unequipped my Magnera. Like, how did I get that to trigger again? Oh, yeah. Wow! That's a lot of crystals! <laughs> oh, is that a max level Thunder Surge? Why, yes it is! How did I miss this chest in the very first room? Oh boy, and a bounding crystal. Never mind. It wouldn't have, it wouldn't have mattered anyways. <laughs> I've already got plenty of those. Oh, it's these guys. Of all the times not to have a magnet. Well, that did not give me nearly as much ice cream as I would have liked. Oh boy, let's go outside! No chests out here, so we'll just peace out. Oh wait, no, I don't want to be in this room. Back to the ship exterior! Man, then you can't go very fast on your hoverboard. No! Wanna go in the teleporter. Okay. In this room, we should be able to maybe level up the Stitch Key Link a bit more. The enemies in here are all pretty easy to deal with. Oh, the transporter's not even working properly. Oh, I guess we don't even get to go to the Turo Transporter. What about all the treasures, then? I'm missing two of them. How can this be? Oh no, I bet I know. I bet the last chests are in the room where we fought the boss. I just didn't explore all of that room. Well, we're still going the right way then. <laughs> yeah, move on, guys. I, I don't want to talk to y'all. I just want the treasure. There's one of them. A chaos crystal. Is that like the chaos emerald? Because if it's not, I really don't care about it at all. Ah, here's the other one. Mind shield! Sweet. It's one step closer to getting mind square, which is a great ability. You guys saw how good it was in Terra's story, after all. I think we've now reached the part where I'm going to just play a bunch of command board in the Mirage Arena. Hopefully level up some commands, so I'll see you guys once I'm done with that. Yeah, yeah, take that, Gantu. We did not max out our Spark Raid somehow. That's weird. We got a bunch of other stuff to max level, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, that feels good. Oh, yeah, this is great. Pulse Bomb! We put in a bunch of money in, so we got it to level up. And we also leveled up our Absolute Zero by a bit. And we got more medals. And we won free Command Board a game, so we get the Arena level up, too. Alright, now we're going to the Tune Board. Oh boy. This will be fun. Man, I sniped victory from Mini at the very end there. I used two navigator commands in a row in order to reach the bank, get paid, and then move back to the bank in order to actually win. So yay, Treasure Raid and Spark Raid are both maxed out. We got some Blizzards and a Blizzara up. Leveled up our Kuraga a bit. Got Pulse Bomb to max level. Got Absolute Zero to max level. Yeah! We've collected a thousand medals! Nice! Oh. 
Oh, this is weird. Because we've cleared Terra's story at this point, we actually have the skull board and the secret board already. Oh, well, that's fascinating. Well, we're going to do the honey pot board next, and we're actually going to play with free players because I need Pooh and Tigger in my character uh, guide in order to complete the journal. And the only time you've got them added to the journal is if you play up against them in the command board. This also means we need to land on one of the sparkly squares in order to trigger Rabbit's event. Because that's, again, the only way you can get Rabbit added as a character. Talk Why does it reset the speed every time I go in here? This is very annoying. Oh, good! <laughs> we get to see Rabbit now. Rabbit appearing in this cutscene is enough to warrant his own character entry in the journal. So if you're missing a character from your journal, make sure Rabbit is one of them. That was maybe the stupidest ending to a command board I've ever seen. Tigger and Pooh both got stuck at the top of the course and kept having to give money to the prize cubes, so they were like dirt poor at the end there. I passed the bank and got a checkpoint. I didn't even realize I had enough GP in order to win the game. Actually, no. So on my last turn, I, I was confused. J Tigger had used the Joker's Fortune and it, it had randomly ended up on Confused, so I couldn't choose where I went. I used Joker's Fortune on my turn and got triple dice. I rolled them. I passed a checkpoint, which gave me enough overall GP in order to win. And then the confusion made me go in exactly the right direction, right back to the bank, and I won. It was very stupid. I also barely got to put any commands down. I put down Fire Surge, Thunder Stop, Super Glide, and Renewal Block, and that's it. <laughs> but a win is a win. <laughs> it's the end of the road for you, Peter Pan. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, um, <laughs> this is why the Neverland board is the <laughs> most ridiculous board of all of them. If you do a one-on-v-one -on -one match and get a really expensive property right at the start, you can just keep landing on the pixie dust squares and forcing Peter Pan to land on them over and over again, and he has to pay you all his money, and there's really nothing he can possibly do to get back. <laughs> it's fun. Fair and balanced. And that's what we call a slaughter. Peter Pan only had one panel at the end, and it was only... He only had that one panel because he used a random joker at the end, and it gave him a free panel. That was literally the only reason. It was amazing. <laughs> that mini's never getting leveled up. Also, I completely forgot that, um... I got air slide, and I never actually equipped it. So that's funny. Whoops. Should have equipped that bad boy. Oh well. As for the shot lock commands, well, I'll equip Pulse Bomb, I guess. Is break time maxed out? No, it's not. Lovely. Fundara Thunder for Fundaga. Oh! Oh! Fundara plus Thunder normally gives you Fundaga, but we got lucky and it gave us the Lightning Ray shot lock instead. Oh, I'm, I'm down for that. That's great. <laughs> All right, now we'll meld two Funders together with a Shimmering Crystal to actually get the Thunder Boost. We can start melding these Blizzards together in order to get Blizzard Boost. Because we haven't gotten those yet. Boom, free Blizzard Boosts, just like that. Another thing we can do is Fyraga. Plus Slow. With a Soothing Crystal. Crawling Fire with HP Boost. Stop, stop. Shimmering Crystal gives us Stop Row with Thunder Boost for some reason. I don't know why. But now we can play the uh, secret board and hopefully level up some of those nice commands. I'm only playing with two players. I don't like the competition. Well, that was a very long game, but we <laughs> got a bunch of stuff. So we got Blitz, two Fundaras, and a Magnara. Hey, we got an Aerial Slam too. What happened to that? I fought out Terra's Aerial Slam. Why didn't we grab that? Or maybe that's not, maybe we'll see that over here. I hope so. Oh, that's a lot of fun dies. Oh, yes. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Yes, Air Slide got to max. Yes, Super Glide got to max. Where did my Aerial Slam go? I bought one. This is bogus. Well, now I get to do Rumble Racing. <laughs> Yay. All right, there we go. All the Rumble Racing down. Wonderful. With our 2,500 medals, I think I will buy Photon Charge. Yes, that seems like a good idea. <laughs> Wonderful. 
Actually, this recording took so long that Audacity crashed partway through. I salvaged the recording, but I had to basically restart Audacity and record this in two parts commentary. So that's fun. Apparently I can't really go over two hours of Audacity recording or else bad stuff happens. So, we're gonna end the video there. Thanks for watching it, everybody. Next time we go to Neverland. Where we learn to glide, even though we've already learned how to super glide. Yeah. Should, should be great. Look forward to that next time. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.